What's up, y'all? No, not y'all. Hey, guys. Let Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am King and welcome to King's Closet. This is my very first YouTube video. I'm excited. So the thing is, like, I go by many different names. Um, the amount of aliases I have, you would think I'm a scammer. Um, some people call me King. Most people call me Stan. And when I cash some checks, I write Darren on the dotted line. So we're going to start with King. My social name on social media is Vintage King. Um, this was way back when, when I used to thrift heavy. So I'm like, okay. You know, I, I went through a phase when, like, I was, you know, with all the printed blazers and, you know, the high-waisted pants and stuff like that. Like, I, my vibe was vintage and I was the Vintage King. So, you know, I didn't want to spell king with a K, so I was trying to be cute and different, and I used a Q instead. So, that's how Vintage King came about. The funny thing is, a lot of people ask me, like, you know, where did Stan come from? Y'all know the movie Next Friday. So, when Mr. Jones was going to uh, get his son Craig from Daddy House or whatever like that, he had a burrito, and he had to use the bathroom. So, he went, to, he pulled over to this gas station, went to use the bathroom, somebody was in the bathroom, he banging on the door, trying to get in the bathroom. Stanley was in the bathroom. So Stanley tried to warn Mr. Jones, like, don't go in here. I don't know what happened. Like, something must have died in me, this and the third. And he said, get the fuck out of my face, Stanley! And my cousin's been calling me Stanley ever since then. And now my whole family calls me Stan. And I decided to capitalize on it. Who is Stan? Me. I'm Stan. Stan is me. I'm also King, and I'm also Darren. So, you know, you can call me what you want. You know, uh, my family calls me Stan. People from social media calls me Stan. People I went to high school with and my partner, they call me Darren. Like, I feel like it's weird for them to call me, um, you know, for them to call me Stan because y'all knew me as Darren. You met me as Darren. Don't call me Stan. Like, I feel like it's just really weird. Like, Stan. Who you talking to? No, I don't like that. So let me tell you a little bit about myself. You know, I'm an entrepreneur. I am a wardrobe stylist. I have my own online accessory boutique called I Am King. Um, I'm a visual merchandiser. Like anything fashion, it's it's in me. You know, like that's what I like to do. That's my zhuzh. And that's pretty much it. Like I got my degree from Berkeley College in fashion. Like your boy is smart. All right, now don't get it twisted, honey, okay? The reason I started a YouTube channel was because I feel like there is a false pretense on who I am or, like, how other people perceive me. And, like, a lot of people, I, I get this all the time, that people think I'm stuck up, like, I, I don't speak, this, that, and the third. I'm like... I, I, what? Like, I'm not the type of person to be walking around, hi, my name is this. Hey, how are you? And this, that, and the third. Like, if we make eye contact, I'll give you a head nod or speak and stuff like that. But that's just not my personality. Like, I'm really a nice, fun, outgoing person, you know? And I feel like a lot of people get hooked up on, you know, when I come in a room, I command attention. And it's not like I do it on purpose. Like, hey, y'all, I'm here. Look at me. But, you know, the way that I dress, it, it stands out to people. And, you know, a lot of people don't know how to take that, I guess. So... That's why I wanted to, you know, start this channel so y'all can get a gist of who I am as a person versus, you know, what, what y'all think y'all know. What can you expect from my YouTube channel? You can expect a variety of things. I want this channel to consist of everything that is me. Like, you know, fashion, food, lifestyle, a lot of vlogs, you know, some how-tos, maybe some DIYs, closet hauls, you know, try-on hauls, all that kind of stuff. That's what I want my channel to consist of. Kind of versatile, like me. 
<laughs> but anyway, I did a post on my Instagram story, you know, asking questions people wanted me to ask on my YouTube channel and stuff like that. So I chose about five different questions. Let's see. Question number one. Who would you love to work with? Cash Doll. I would like to work with Cash Doll, honestly and truly. First of all, first and foremost, me and Cash Doll, that's my sub. That's my friend. So, you know, I feel like, friend, come on, let's work together and let's get these looks. Let's make these pieces hit, child. Like, I feel like she doesn't have a set team right now. Um, you know, like Cardi B, she has, you know, Colin Carter and she has Tokyo Styles on hair. Like, she doesn't have a set team. So, I'm your guy. Put me on your team, sis. So, Cash Doll, you, sir, call me, okay? Um, next question. How many siblings do I have? I have three siblings. I am the youngest of four. Um, yeah. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What keeps you motivated? Um, what keeps me motivated? I feel like the people around me keep me motivated. Like, I have a small circle of friends that I run with heavy, you know, that I talk to frequently and stuff like that. So, you know, we communicate about how we're feeling and stuff like that. So it's like, when I'm down, they're there to pick me up and, you know, tell me everything's going to be all right. You know, it's temporary and stuff like that. Like, my immediate circle, they are the people that keep me motivated. Next question. Um, what inspires your style? <sighs> oh, my aspiration in life. I feel like everything around me inspires my style. Like, I don't have, like, one set style. It depends on how I'm feeling, honestly and truly. Like... If I wake up today and I go get a haircut and I'm feeling like the baddest puta, oh, child, I'm going to put on a cha-cha boot and I'm going to click-clack through these halls so y'all can see me coming. But if I'm like, child, it is what it is, pay it. Like, I might throw in a sweatsuit and some Uggs and just keep it pushing, you know? So, like, I take, you know, a lot of inspiration from, you know, the things around me, you know, like what's trending and stuff like that. But mostly... Pretty much on how I feel that day. Last question. When did you come out to your family? Ciao. Honestly, it truly, really, I, I really didn't come out. Like, you know how people had these coming out stories and stuff like that. Like, it was more so implied. Like, the girls already knew. But it wasn't nothing for me to tell because it was none of y'all business. Let's start there. We're going to finish there, too. So, one year, like, it was New York Pride. And I was going with my friends. It was my first time going. And my mother asked my asked me why was I going to the city or whatever. I'm like, I'm like going to Pride or whatever. She was like, well, what you going there for? I'm like, because I'm gay, mom. Like, what? And she was like, oh, okay. Like, I was waiting for you to tell me. Like, I always knew. I was just waiting for you to tell me. I'm like. So what you asked me for if you already knew? Like, girl, go, go on, go on. So at the end of every episode, I'm going to have a segment called What's in King's Closet? Um, pretty much it's just going to be like one or two things that I pick out that is my favorite piece right now. And I'm just going to tell you a little bit about it. So on today's episode, what's in King's Closet is my fedora. So they come in three different colors. You know, you got your heather gray here, your black here, and your royal blue on my dome up top. Um, they come with, uh, detachable bands. They're unisex. I try to make my pieces suitable for men and women. So, you know, anybody can wear this hat. You can do so much with it. Like, you can dress it up, dress it down. You can wear it with a t-shirt, some jeans, and like a little sneaker. Or you can wear it with a suit. And these hats can be found at www.iamking.us. So that's www.iamking.us. So that's... What's in King's Closet? So that's going to conclude my intro. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment, subscribe, turn on the notification post so you can, you know, keep up with King and King's Closet. I am King, and thank you for stopping by King's Closet.